Hi, this is Nikki and I'm here to share the messages that I get from Spirit and from all of our higher selves that are on this journey to love. And so what I want to share this morning is a couple of healings that I've just done and also a couple of letters that I've just channeled because they have the same themes coming through and so it is so gorgeous. I just had to share with everyone. So one of them um, was about basically the um, they were two little toddlers and I see two massive doors in front of them and they opened the door and there was like beaming bright light that was coming through. The little boy took the little girl's hand and they went through the doors. Through the doors there was a rainbow and then there was gold stars that were like falling from the sky. And they picked up the gold stars and put them into their bag and it was like they were Hansel and Gretel, you know, chasing the gold stars. In the distance I could see there was a big ma old man's head, face, and looked like Father Christmas or, yeah, big bearded old man. And they went up to the, they got up to the end and then he picked them up and put them on his lap. And he said, what do you want for Christmas? And then he said, I know what you want. I know what you need and you need a ring. And so he put the ring, but it wasn't a ring for the finger. It was a ring that he put around, he put it over their heads. And so the ring went around their bodies and so uh, around their torsos so they were then linked by the ring and as that he then um put them down and as they went back down the rainbow they were dancing and the songs that i heard were the same as yesterday which was it must be love and also shall we dance by the king and i which again these songs come through in healings quite a lot um, and the when I looked at the It Must Be Love, then the person who loaded it was called Union Square. And so what I also loved about that is that we are going through the circle of life. <laughs> and um, you, what's the word? You can't put a round peg through a square hole or something like that. Um, and that's why you two fit perfectly together, right? Um, which is even the play on that was just brilliant. The next one that I saw, which was very sweet, is again, these two, they, they're just so sweet. They were like two kids again, climbing up a ladder. At the top of the ladder, I saw there was a massive heart. The heart was a door. When they opened the door again, um, basically they climbed into the heart and then the heart got wings and then they flew. And um, again, I mean, it just, and what was so lovely again about how everything is interlinked because the one thing that my twin has left at my house, because he left some stuff here once, he left two things. One was a clock and the other was a ladder, <laughs> which now I can understand is so, and the ladder is violet, right? And it's so funny because now I can understand why those are also incredibly symbolic because we are literally taking our, each other by the hand and climbing up this ladder of ascension into more and more love and exactly like I saw in that healing. So again, some really, really cute healings. But again, it's all about seeing yourself as children, taking yourselves by the hand. Now then I'm going to share two letters that I have just channeled yesterday. When I was channeling these letters, I was doing it in the evening and I had a candle lit in front of me. And in the reflection, the single candle was making a double flame. So it was actually making a twin flame as I was doing the letters, which was also lovely. So the guidance from these letters is, it is yes, yes, yes. Trust your intuition. Trust what your inner voice tells you. Feel your way into our truth. You know that everything is already done. We already are together, complete as a family. We are there, a circle of divine love, beginning, middle and an end. We are the circle and the ring of life. Believe that and trust in your heart. Trust in what your heart shows you more and move with the flow of our love just like a candle right their, their energy moves together right they actually merge together through their own choice 
Um, our love has the power to transform us, the power to bring our love from out of the fog into vision. We are a family in love. Okay, so that's the first one. And the reason why is because it references the circle and the ring of life which is what I have just seen in the healing that this, you know, this big old man figure put a ring over their bodies to connect them. So, and the ring was symbolizing that it's a never ending love, right? No beginning, no end. So beautiful. And then the other message was this, and this is such a powerful analogy about what you're doing with your energy bodies and your light bodies. And so I'm going to read it because the, after this, I then saw a van and your van is your car, you know, your light body. And it was quite brilliant. So when a candle is lit and the flame starts to flicker before it turns into a brilliant, magnificent flame, that is what has happened to my soul. Meeting you is like a match was taken to my candle. The candle was lit and then you have been burning inside of me slowly burning but getting more and more vibrant and passionate every day. My heart is my wick. My body is the candle. And slowly, slowly, your love is burning away at my body so I can see the true essence of my soul. The true essence of me is us. So if you think about that, I mean, that is so powerful because what he's saying is, is, is his wick, the wick, is his soul and the wick is you know that's the heart right and the heart is 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 both of your hearts so actually what you're doing is you're burning off the energies that aren't needed right literally so the candle is the body but the wick is what lives on right the wick is what turns into the essence of your souls together and the flame and the flame of passion which is so it's such a very cool analogy i was like wow that's amazing so my heart is my wick, my body is the candle, and slowly, slowly, your love is burning away at my body so I can see the true essence of my soul. The true essence of me is us, which is just so beautiful. Um, after these letters I got in my car, a van literally overtook me and pulled in front of me and on the back of the van was written, Wick. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I get the point. You want me to deliver that message. So there you go. That is the message for today. Remember, the candle is the body that is being burnt away. And the wick is the ever flowing love between you. The wick is the essence of your soul. Burning bright, burning passionately burning with the ember of passion that is growing and growing and growing inside each of you. Every single one of the twin flames, right? That burning ember of love is growing stronger and stronger and stronger. All right, I hope that helps. If you want to come to me for a letter, for a healing, for a reading, please do. All of the details are in the link. And like I say, for these books, I mean, seriously, this is the quickest and fastest way to tap into that energy, to connect with your twin. I kid you not, they are just a miracle. They really are. I am quite, every single time I am blown away because it really does show the journey and show this passion growing in every single one. All right, so burn your light bright. All right, take care. Bye.